Hey guys, today I wanna to show you some things that might make fun holiday gifts. For dog moms or service dog handlers, depending on what category you fall in. But most of this could just be for any dog owner or any dog lover. So this is actually a drawstring bag. It's like one of those drawstring backpack things from Pop Your Pup. And what you can do at Pop Your Pup, you can get, I think they have like a hundred different things. They have a ton of different things. They have things from like t-shirts, socks, um, blankets, pillows. They have a bunch of different bags, cosmetic bags, duffel bags, bags like this, tote bags, literally anything you can think of, they have a way to put your dog on it. So what you do is you send them in just a photo of your dog and then they, you know, basically remove the background and draw it up for you so that it looks, you know, like this. Um, and then they send you that back for approval. After you approve that, then you pick your background. And they have a ton of different backgrounds to pick from. Um, I just picked this, I think it's like boho feathers or something. I liked this design a lot, but they have a ton of stuff to pick from. So that's the first thing on the list. Um, and we actually have a code, it's pop 10 and that gets you 10% off your order but I love this and it's actually super nice quality too. I wasn't sure um, whenever I ordered from them because you know, you never know. You never know what kind of quality it's gonna be. Um, but it's actually really good quality and it's made in the US, so that's awesome. So that's the first thing. The other fun thing that would be a great gift would be custom stickers of your dog or obviously of your, if you were gonna give this as a gift, maybe of you know the person's dog or cat that you are gifting it to. So these are the ones that we have. These are from Sticker Mule. I don't have a discount code or anything for them, but they usually are running promotions. They have holographic stickers that you can pick from. Um, obviously they have different shapes. They have die cut, so it's actually cut out in a shape. On this one, we just did Fairy's Instagram handle. So this is what we keep to pass out. Like if we run into people, who are asking too many questions and I don't have time to answer, we hand out something like this so they can get information because I post a lot about service dogs and service dog etiquette over there. I will link Sticker Mule below for you guys. There's other websites that do it too, but we've had a lot of luck with Sticker Mule, so stickers. So the next thing is custom art. I will link the place that we got Farabee's drawing from because I really like this person. They were super fun to work with. They did a great job. I always forget to say something in a video and have to pop on here later. <laughs> so right now I'm talking about Villa's art and I've just shown you guys the custom piece that we got of Farabee. And I forgot to tell you guys that they offered a 10% off code to anyone who shows that they are subscribed to my channel. So all you have to do is just show them that you are subscribed and you know, of course you get 10% off your order. I'll link them in the description box for you guys. Now, this is something that I think any dog owner who takes their dog places could use. This is the Sleepy Pods um, car harness. We have the Click It Terrain. They also make a Click It Sport. We have the Terrain. Fairby wears a medium in this. Like I said, this could be a gift for your dog, but your dog probably doesn't really care about this. So, be more of a gift for the human. <laughs> um, and these are around $100, so it would be a good gift. These last two things are service dog handler specific and they're things that I have actually made and created. So I wanna suggest those to you as well. The first thing are my service dog training journals. I'll pop those on the screen for you guys. These are actually digital downloads. So you can edit them on your phone, your tablet, your computer. Of course you can print them out as well, but it's a great way to keep track of your service dog training. Um, I have task ideas on there. I have socialization checklist in there. There's ideas of how to structure your weekly training and a lot more. So I will link those for you guys below. It is a digital download, so you get it instantly as soon as you download it. Last but not least are my service dog handler tees. You guys, these have become such a handy item for me to have. So I'm gonna get them in a second and show you, but I have masks, I have hoodies, I have tees, long sleeve tees, and tanks. And basically, I don't wear these every single time I go out, but I wear them whenever I know I'm having a rough day and I have to go somewhere anyway. And I just know that I don't have the brain power to deal with people asking questions or stopping me a million times or whatever. So I have several styles of these to choose from. And this is the newest one that I got, interfering with a service dog is a crime. So this is the back. My dog is my medical equipment, interfering with a service dog is a crime. And then it has the, you know, the no-no signs. <laughs> Leave my dog alone. <laughs> 
Um, and this one's long sleeve. Um, you can actually get this in a short sleeve and a hoodie as well. This one is a back print only. Some of them have it on the front and the back, um, but this one just says service dog handler, interfering with a service dog is a crime, do not distract, and then it also has these. I have them that don't have these symbols as well. I just like this because I think it gets attention. But this one is a V-neck. There's a lot of different colors. There's a lot of different font colors, and there's a lot of different like prints to pick from. And then some of them do have a actual silhouette of a dog on there. I do have the Fab Four because obviously I can't like go through and pick every single dog breed out. Um, but some of them do not have any dogs at all. This one, please ignore us. It is a crime to distract service dogs. And then it just has a poodle. This is a front print only. We also have a few things of Farabee merch on there. It's like uh, baby Farabee stuff and it says hug dealer. So if you just want to get something with a sweet little baby Farabee on there, there are some things like that available too. We have stickers for sale. I think there's some pillows, there's a poster, some stuff like that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found some of these gift ideas interesting and helpful. Everything I mentioned will be linked below for you guys. Don't forget to use Farabee Pop 10 if you buy something at Pop Your Pup. And we will link some videos around here for you guys and a subscribe button up here. And we will see you guys soon. Bye guys. Fairby's leaning against me. She's tired. You see me? Yeah. Bye, guys. <laughs>